oh, and only one place to start, isn't there? Just kind of sum up how you're feeling after that ending to that game. Yeah, uh, only just got me, me breath back, to be honest. <laughs> I think I ran through the whole stadium celebrating, but uh, yeah, it's nice, uh, nice score goal like that, but even better when it's finished to win the game the last minute, I suppose. Uh, I've never done it like that in my career before, so I'm just really happy for everyone, really happy for the lads, and uh, yeah, I think the second half performance deserved the win. You could kind of see how much it meant to you as well with the celebration. You just said you'd run around the whole stadium, but it was well worth it, wasn't it? Yeah, I've, I've, I've had a bit of slagging, to be fair. My, uh, few, I've, had, I've obviously had a baby about seven months ago. They're always on to me about doing the Rock the Baby celebration, but uh, haven't scored since she's been born. So when the lad said she'll be five before I score, but um, <laughs> I, can, I can shut him up now. Thanks very much. Just talk us through the goal and uh, from when it started, when you intercepted that pass in the right two. Yeah. yeah, well, uh, I think they had the ball about halfway line and they passed it and I just read that the guy was going to flick it around the corner and took a bit of a gamble, to be honest. Uh, got there first and then I was going to pass it wide, but I thought I might as well have a run and uh, chopped inside. And then I was going to play AB, but the centre back dropped off with him, so I thought, who am I going to pass it to next? And I think Noobs was on my right, that looked like it was cut off, so I just took another touch and kind of seen a bit of a gap in the corner, thought, why not? And, uh, yeah, flew in, so happy days. <laughs> is that one of the best feelings you've, you've ever had on, on football pitch? Yeah, you? I'd say so probably, yeah. I think uh, it's a first for me. Obviously, I don't score many goals, but um, it's the first time doing that in my career. So, yeah, I'd probably say it's up there, definitely. And you just said then, from the second half performance, we deserved all three points, didn't we? They really came out in that second half. Yeah, uh, I think first half, I think, you know, we'll all admit it was very, very poor. Uh, couldn't really seem to get near, it seemed like. But um, you're always in the game at one nil, I think, and especially... Um, you know, we played that poorly, never going to really play that poorly again. In the second half, just said that at half time, we'll have a spell in the game. And uh, I think from the first minute of the second half, we were kind of all over them and the way better team. So I think it was coming. Obviously, we had the, the goal disallowed through offside. Um, but yeah, I felt like um, it was only going to be one team winning it, to be honest. And it was us the whole second half. How do you feel changed for, sort of at half time and going into to that second half from that, that first half? Yeah, well, I think we, we got we got to grips a little bit with, with what they were doing. I think um, to cause a bit of trouble in the, in the first half, I think we were kind of a bit deep as, as a team, as a whole, and there was kind of probably too much space for us to cover. Um, and then I think, yeah, we just sorted it out at half time. We pushed maybe five, ten yards higher up the pitch and pressed more as a team instead of like individuals trying to go after the ball. And I uh, just think we got a better shape and probably looked after the ball a bit better when we got it back as well. And um, yeah, that was the difference. I think we just got a foothold in the game and um, allowed us to kind of um, put our stamp on, on the second half, I suppose. Well, it's kind of the, the end now for the last three games of the season. Is it to try and pick up as, as many points as we can? Yeah, I think so. Um, obviously, we've got three tough games. I think Exeter are flying. Um, so we've got them on Saturday. That's next. So we'll just look to that. I think um, we're comfortably safe and mathematically safe, aren't we, after today? So I think you know that's, a, that's obviously um, a nice thing. But um, yeah, we just we have to go there on Saturday you know, and, and, and try and play our way again. And, and put our stamp on the game like we did second half and, and then hopefully get a result. What's the plan for tonight? Going to go back and watch the, the goal on loop? <laughs> I think it's been sent to me about 15 times <laughs> already. Um, but yeah, uh, just yeah, so I usually like to turn my phone off there now because it'll probably be beeping all night. But um, yeah, just relax I suppose and um, probably have a Chinese with the missus or something. <laughs> Lovely. Thank you very much.